you know, having vitiligo um, is, is not good. It's much better to be your own skin color. And certainly if your skin's darker, it becomes more obvious. But I've seen hundreds, thousands of people over the years who are very light, lighter than me, and they get deep pigmentation and they hate it. And I, I would feel the same way. Now, the best thing you can do is try to get the color back. But that's always not always possible. Sometimes you just can't get it back, and so rather than going through life having two colors, you can, you can use a cream, it is a cream, you apply it once a day, twice a day, and you can take off the color that's remaining. So you end up with one color. Now, the most famous example of this, of course, is, is Michael Jackson. And he used this cream called monobenzone, and you apply it to your skin, and it's not something that happens overnight. It takes maybe a year, and for Michael Jackson, maybe longer. I, I don't know how long it took. It's a slow process. Benaquin or monobenzone, those are the same medication, was available until approximately a year ago. And then the company that uh, manufactured it, for reasons I don't know, but I suspect because they didn't, they didn't sell very much, discontinued the manufacture. But there are a number of pharmacies that will make this product. And, and so people can get a prescription, they need a prescription from their physician, from their dermatologist, send it to one of these, these pharmacies and they'll make it. I, we do that all the time. Well, you know, um, for most of these situations, you can get this uh, sometimes locally in a pharmacy. Now, what you need to find is what, what's called a, a formulating pharmacy. 40 or 50 years ago, when you went to the pharmacist, he made everything. He'd get his little mortar and pestle out and grind it up and put some goo and juice and stuff in there. And then he would make a cream or he'd make some pills. With the advent of the mo modern pharmaceutical uh, industry, most of this stuff comes pre prepared. And it's in a tube or pills or whatever. And, and as I say, a Benequin was available. Uh, but it's not any more from the company, but there are many pharmacists, and probably one in every community, uh, they actually have a, a group of what are called formulating pharmacists, and they, they can kind of make anything. So it could be more convenient to go locally, but if not, there are some national resources.